Hi, this is Shane and welcome back to a brand new series, Rust Rustic Waters 2. Um, I didn't play Rustic Waters 1. I have no idea what this mod pack is about, apart from the fact it's under the ocean. That's all I can tell you. Um, if you can hear when you hover over stuff, it goes, you know, you hear bubble pops, which is pretty cool. Um, so yeah, I'm going into this absolutely blind as usual and uh, difficulty normal allow cheats on I always play with cheats on because you know I don't have to if something happens I don't have to worry right um great new world I don't think we need to put in a seed because it's under the ocean uh what The hell? Um, okay. Snow leopard? What? Okay. I'm underwater. Stone lamp. Okay, there's a quest book. What's this? Captain's log recorder. There's a whale out there. Crew hat. This is Michelle Valentine, Captain of Recon Frigate Liberty. We launched Marauder 600. My crew is on seven of the finest men and women this side of the Andromeda. It'll take us three weeks to reach the jump gate and another five to hit her. And if all goes as planned, we'll be loaded up and back home by spring. Tomorrow's a big day. Michelle Valentine, signing off. Um, okay. <laughs> I, I don't, uh, crewman's cap, night vision and respiration. Okay. Oh, I'm in a funky uniform. Nice. I... <laughs> I have no idea what to think. What are these? Up expansion lock. Okay. And these are... Okay, so when we're ready to... To stuff, when we're ready to expand... Okay. I was expecting what? Devaria? Um being that you're named, I'm assuming you're a companion. Um I know enough about the um, these things to know that you knock off the apples and then you put the sprouts back on the trees so we've got an early game source food source um do you want to get off the tree snow leopard I don't know I'd the fact it hasn't attacked us, I guess, is a good thing. Um, let's open the quest book. Welcome to Rustic Waters 2. You've just landed in the ocean after plummeting from space. If you're the only survivor, single player, continue to the next page of this quest book to make sense of your situation and begin this adventure. If there are more survivors, multiplayer, please select the light purple heart icon on the upper left of this quest book to receive your own emergency hub spawn key. Use this key to be immediately teleported and placed within your own separate hub. Good luck crew member. Okay, well it's just me, so next page. Alright, so how do you 
get to the oh okay let's pin this a tragic start wow okay oh this is this is so cool this is a, a lot of effort went into this as you can tell Caladan's elite military unit? What? Oh. This is going to take us a while. But this is, wow, this is really well put together. Okay, so we're going to be the hero of Caladan. I'm guessing. Chip ID type nine nine hundred M frigate nine hundred meter frigate. Full sign Liberty Shipmaster Captain Michelle Valentine. She was on the the crew log thing. Occupants fifty four, crew forty eight, service animal six, status non responsive. Okay, so I'm guessing we need. To get to here, your first hub expansion creates in this. Okay. I can see why my friend was telling me, try this. They know that they know I don't like create. <sighs> okay. Devaria, your friendly hub companion. Okay, so she's not gonna kill me. I'm assuming it's a she. Tool belt. Is that Tetra? I don't know. Right. Settling into your new underwater hub. I guess we start here and we work down. Oh yes, I'm now seeing the arrows. A bit faint. I don't know if you can see it on your screen. But the arrows are pointing round in lots of directions. Okay, right, let's start. Um, you can repeatedly sneak or twerk to quicken the growth time of trees. The last thing you remember is sitting at the control panel of the recon frigate called Liberty, awaiting your descent into Earth's atmosphere. The rest is a blur, but you regained a bit of consciousness as your emergency escape pod plummeted towards Earth. As it hit the ocean surface, it deployed a personnel survival hub to keep you safe. You will now have to muster every bit of your training to figure out what happened and how to survive. Start by breaking down the tree you see. Okay, we need four oak logs. Okay, so we, you know, basic Minecraft stuff is, no, I don't think Ultra Miner's in this, but that's okay. Deveria, I hope you don't sustain damage as you fall out of the tree. Oh, fast leaf decay is not in this. Okay, cool. All right, but you can twerk to get more trees to um to to grow. Okay. Hello. Alex's mobs is in this, but that's okay. I don't know what you eat. I hope you don't. Well, I can't feed you yet. Um, yeah, let's take a look at the quest book. Uh, Rustic Waters 2 Guide. And what's in the guide? It's a highly customized plaque. pack. Please take some time to browse the categories on the right to familiar yourself with some major changes. Uh, also, feel free to join the Discord for um, assistance. The invite can be found on the main menu. Okay, story so far. Okay. All right, I'm going to have, I'm not going to read this all on camera. But it's, um, it's a lot. And the mod pack maker 
has obviously gone into a lot they've, they've gone to a lot of effort deep sea hub okay they've gone into a lot of oh, dif difficulty oh my days really yeah so i'm gonna have to go over this because i'm not going to read this all on camera now diet there are no penalties for eating only simple foods but there are benefits for eating complex meals okay okay that's good because i really hate doing packs where across your travels you mean so we have to leave this thing we have to go out in the water i don't want to go in the water but anyway um colored altars and their gateways to cubic dungeons and the three dungeons represent their theme and their difficulty so light blue green and black okay yeah, like I said, I'm going to go through it off camera. Let's just go through the quest book for now. Uh, make a crafting table. You see wildlife through the glass in your hub, and that's a good sign. Food can be found here to supplement the apples on the tree. Apple sprouts can be planted on any leaf blocks, even if they're not attached to a tree. And sneaking while axe in the bottom block will cause, will chop the whole tree at once and cause the leaves to decay. Okay. Oh, good girl, you're lying down. Um, oh, I was there looking at that. I didn't even think about trying to get saplings. Ah, uh, right. What are we supposed to do? Make a, a crafting table. I'm assuming it's the same. Oh, you know what? Um, client modify advanced center search. No, advanced center search on. Yeah, save. Yeah, I prefer having the search centered. I don't know why. It just I just like it. Okay, so we get sixteen cobblestone. And we make a workbench. Certain resources like raw fish and driftwood can be dried on the campfire for things like leather or logs. Okay, so we've landed with some equipment, the uniform and the quest manual. Alright, so we need to make the workbench. And the workbench is a crafting table and two bits of cobble. Oh, what was that? Engineer's crafting table. Immersive is in this. Oh, joy. Oh, well, actually, I haven't played Immersive for a while. It might have gotten more interesting. A crafting table that keeps it in its inventory when it's closed. Okay. I don't know where to put this. Um, we should see what kind of pickaxes and stuff we have in here. Although, to be honest, Mystical Agriculture is in this. Space Boss Tools. Applied Energistics. Uh, I was kind of hoping Tetra was in this, but it's not. Ars Nouveau. Atom is in this. Okay. Click, click. But yeah, apparently attack damage and attack speed. You should also look at the attack speed, and that's more important than attack damage. There was um tips on you know when the pack when the mod pack's loading up, there was tips at the beginning, and that was one of them. So is this the same? It seems to be the same recipes. Okay. Okay. At least that has oh, we've got the market. How do you make the market? Oak logs, carpet, iron. Oh, they've changed it. Okay. Oh. Okay. Our diet. Okay. And of course, we've got this 
FTB chunks. Let's claim our chunk. Why do I always end up being right in the middle of a chunk? Well, there's an island out here. Okay, I guess we'll get there at some point. Alright, not gonna... <laughs> Are they gonna grow while they're not attached to anything? That would be interesting. Um, yeah, getting sidetracked. Getting sidetracked. Alright, let's put you down... Here. Balance larger stack. Balance and match larger stack. Empty the grid. Okay. Do we make sticks in the same way? Okay. Right. Before we do that, let's have a look at the quest book. Because there could be a different way of doing things. All right. What's the raw fish for? Is it to feed Devaria? Or is it to feed me? Spinning wheel. Much like other cats, Devaria serves no real purpose other than to relax all day and keep you company. Okay. Is your first unconventional workstation. You place an item at the top, then right click three or, f three or four times to process the item. The output will appear at the front of the block once complete. Okay. All right, I guess we've got to grow some trees then. I guess the apples do grow, even if they're not attached to anything. They're magic apples. Who would have thought that magic exists in this, in, in this place? Caladan, isn't that the name of Lady Jessica's homeworld? in Dune. Pretty sure of it. I am pretty sure of it. Okay, we need an axe. Let's make an axe. Oh, we need some more. Right, keep you, put you there. And what did it say about the trees? Um, sneaking while axing the bottom block of a tree will chop down the whole tree. Okay. Oh, nice. Okay, got three saplings. I think what we're gonna have to do is move one of these blocks over and just have it as a tree. Sneak. Okay. Oh, do they auto plant? Because I didn't put those there. Do the trees auto plant? They do. Oh, that is amazing. I love that. Okay, well, you know, that's awesome. Right, let's close you. You're annoying. Um, okay, so we got 48 of those. We. Oh, dog inventories. I wonder how Devaria is going to cope with having a dog. Because, you know, dog. And cats, right? Spinning wheel. We're missing the wooden hopper. Chest. We don't want a trap chest. We just want a chest. All right. Is a chest done in the same way? Yes, it is. And we want a wooden hopper, so we need some slabs.
So I'm guessing that um a lot of the recipes are the same, I'm hoping. And we want a wooden gear. We're missing more planks. Alright, that recipe I don't think is the same, but that's okay. Alright, spinning wheel. Alright, let's put let's put the campfire over here out of the way. Because I know I know, but we don't want to knock it down when we expand. Let's put it here. And we can put the cod. Let's cook two. Um, we get a iron axe for that. We place an item at the top, then right click three or four times to process it. So what can we make with our spinning wheel? Don't know. All right, so cloth scraps give you paper. Linen thread gives you rope. String gives you white wool. How do you get string? From flax? How do we get... How do we get seeds? That's the next question. Botany pots are in this. Okay. We have a market. We get coins for stuff. Straining. Okay. All right, I'm going to trust in the process and go through the this. Go through the the quest book. Your escape pod was damaged during landing, and the hub expansion keys must be reassembled by combining three hub key fragments. Once assembled, they will lock unlock an addition. Okay, so we need oak wood shears. Okay. Uh, oh, they've got quite a lot of durability, which is good. So, Daveria, if we talk to you, we're not going to be considered, you know, we won't be going mad, yeah? Because you're alive, you're a thing. We can tell you stuff. It's not like you're a basketball or an inanimate object. You are a highly capable cat. Or snow leopard. Although, how you ended up being with me, I don't know. I mean, do they keep animals on the ship? That's a bit debatable. I don't know. No, shift. Oh, it's not going to be recognised as a tree, I'm guessing, because there's no leaves on it. Okay, let's put down you. Right. Um, I didn't understand. Oh, okay, you had to make the shears and you got a... Oh, okay. You get the hub key fr uh, fragment. And 24 string. Leaves collected by shearing trees can be combined into a bundle of leaves and then woven into string by using your spinning wheel. Okay, so bundle of leaves. I don't know how much string you get, so let's just make four for now. 
Uh, it said that you need to. What was it? You place an item on the top and then right click. Okay. Um, wow. Okay. That's pretty cool. So you click it. And it doesn't matter if there's anything in your hand or not. Oh, that is so cool. That is so cool. Oh, I love that. All right, well, let's make these two more bundles of leaves. And you can only process it one at a time. But that's fine. That is so cool. Uh, we got 24 strings, so we get more shears, and we need three white wool. Uh, place four string in the spinning wheel to create wool. Okay. Can we? I guess we can click it one at a time. <laughs> three. Okay, so that can't do anything more. Okay, so it will take four one after the other. So it knows what you're trying to do. Okay, so if I keep clicking on it with the wool, with the string, it knows that I'm trying to make wool. So after it's got the four string. All right, don't. Let me take this off my hand. And put the wall where I can see it. This is, yeah, this is cool. Okay, so we got three white wool. And we get an iron pickaxe. <coughs> and we need to make a bed. When you die, you will respawn on your bed. Your items take a 35% durability loss, but you will keep your inventory. Hmm, that's interesting. That is very interesting. Okay. I mean, I would like to keep my stuff, even if it does take a durability hit. Okay, we've got a bed, and let's place you here. Okay, what did we get for that? Six leather. A tool belt. You can upgrade your tool belt. Uh, once you've gained and sluiced some, uh, sluiced some resources, revisit this to quest to cut. Really? Shay? Right. Revisit this quest to craft a tool belt. Okay. Oh. I should have gone this way. I don't know why it automatically went there. Okay. A strainer base. Merengue brownies and trail mix. Strainers are too two two block tall items that you place underwater they have to be completely submerged or have flowing water over the net okay but we can get rid of these because we've done those oak planks fence and a wooden hopper we need two okay um Actually, let's put down the chest. I'm going to make it my mission 
to try and keep my inventory as clear as possible. And those of you who know me are there laughing into your into your coffee or whatever you happen to be drinking at the time and try not to snort it all over your keyboard. It's fine. I am trying. Okay. Yeah, the quest book, we don't need that actually. All right, we want, what are we trying to do? Oh, it wants us to make the strainer base. So we need wood. We need to, really, did I stand on you? Sorry. And we need to twerk. And we need the ax. See, this is why I keep everything on me because then I don't have to keep going back and forth. Um, should we shear the leaves? What are we supposed to be? Oh yeah, the strainer base. I don't think I need to do that yet. All right, oak planks. Well, I have to admit, this is very different to the usual punch a tree, thrive and survive. Didn't I make sticks? Yes, I did. Okay, we need four fences. And we need another hopper. Uh, I am missing um, EMC. That's the only thing about EMC. Having Project E in a in a in a pack, it always spoils you. <laughs> always. I didn't need those. I needed chests. Oh no, we need slabs. We need to make two, though. We need to make two. Now we need another hopper. We're missing a chest. And empty the grid. And we're missing slabs. Okay, hopper, and there's another strainer base, and we need to get a bucket of water, although, you know, we can leave the bucket, and, or let go of the water and, leave, and keep the bucket, don't know, we need two survivalist strainers. Okay, how do you make strainers? Was that a zombie? Uh, strainers. Alright, we need more string. We're gonna need more string anyway. Uh, where's the shears? The only thing is, when you do that, you don't get saplings. Do we have any saplings in the chest? We have seven, okay. Is it going to recognize that as a tree? Yes, it does. Alright, cool. So, um... We need to make one survivalist. Balance larger stack? I've no oh, okay, there's not enough to make two. So we need a bundle of leaves. 
Ah, no, don't throw it. Okay, so we need... No? Oh, okay. There you go. I'll make two more because you you always need more. And then... We're missing just one stick. Okay, so that's that. We've got the two meshes and the two strainers. All right, so we'll set those up. Oh, we get oak drawers. Nice. All right, so where can we set these up? Said it needs flowing water. Is this flowing water though? I don't know if this counts as flowing water. But it did say it needs to be underwater as well. And did I put the mesh in the right place? Okay, no, it's... Yes, it's working. Excellent. Alright, I'll leave that there. Let it do what it's doing. Um, yeah. Did I get... Did I get those? Yes, I did. Okay, we'll put those away for now because I don't know what I want to put in it. And put this all up. So... I've just looked at my clock and realized it's time to stop recording, but I'm having way too much fun with this. This I'm I'm liking what what the hell? What is that whale doing? Is it just straight up standing on his tail? <laughs> at least I think it's a whale. The hell? What is that whale doing? Um Okay, that is... Oh, what's that? I don't know what that is, but it looks interesting. But yeah, so... um, Yeah, um, I like this pack. I'm liking it. I'm, it's, a, it's a great thing. I'm really liking the concept behind it and the story and the effort that's gone into it. So... Let's see how this goes. I mean, I'm either going to throw the PC out the window in frustration, or is it night time? Oh, it's night time. Oh, there you go. I don't know how you know it's night time, but there you go. But yes, I'm either going to throw the PC out of the window in frustration, or I'm going to be really happy playing with it. Look, see, I told you that whale is just straight up standing on its tail. There's something wrong with it. Or it's a leviathan like a golem like something i don't know but anyhow thanks very much for watching please like comment and subscribe it really helps to grow my channel and we will see you in the next episode Bye bye